Greetings and welcome back to the Pastafarian and the Age of the FSM. Mm. Today I want to continue um, or I want to enlarge our little farming tower to um, actually bind in the potatoes and carrots we found in the last episode. And I did some off-camera work or more I did some off-camera questing for pumpkins. Um, last time I stumbled upon a patch of pumpkins, a big patch um, actually, which I haven't seen uh, while uh, looking for it. So after I reviewed the footage for editing purposes, I saw that there was a quite large pumpkin patch at the um, down right corner of the map. Um, right under the desert where you can see the um, little green patch over my hunger bar. So I went there, I grabbed some pumpkins and as I was walking back, yeah, I found another pumpkin patch. So now we have 13 pumpkins. We can turn them into seeds, I think um, 16, I think 20 is enough. And we can still use eight of them to craft some jack-o'-lanterns so that we can light up our farming tower. So let me quickly go to sleep, cramped under the ceiling again. And now we can put some light in there so the, the weed can actually grow. Okay, where shall we put it? Mm. So, like here? Oh, you can't really place them sideways. What? You can't place them. Oh, yeah. okay. So we have to trick a little bit to um, actually place them like this. Uh, do I have my hole? Yes. Oh, okay. And it stays there. Okay, we can do this. Perfect. So I want one right here. And yeah. Uh, where should it? No, we can face it outside. Why not? And I think two per area would be alright. So we can replant this. We got glass in here. Hmm. Two. Ah, let's put another one so that the, um, yeah, so we got uh, enough light in here. Okay, number two. And two from there as well, so here, yeah. So yes, as I was telling, I want to put two more areas or three more areas on this farm tower. Um, I think um, I will be doing one for carrots and two for potatoes because um, potatoes are great for food but um, carrots yeah, you actually don't need them that often uh, only for breeding pigs or to um, make some invisibility potions. So, um, as I don't know uh, that I would be doing that, um, I think I will be okay in just having one layer of carrots. I know you can use them as, fo uh, as food as well, um, you can eat them raw, but um, I prefer the potatoes because they heal more hunger. I think they give you back like uh, free and the carrots like too, so um, yeah, we will do some baked potatoes. Great. Okay, so now we can do a... Why am I Steve again? The databank migration isn't complete yet? Okay. Uh, Mojang had an announcement some time ago that they would be doing a database migration for the skins and the skin servers. Um, I thought that until now they would fix that, but apparently, as you can see, I am Steve. 
And for those of you who watched my earlier episodes, um, I've got an another skin, um, kind of a Victorian explorer. And um, yeah, I have to look up what is actually going on there. Alright, so back to the pumpkin patch. So I was thinking of putting it right next to it, uh, to here, uh, to the farming tower. Um, I don't want to do another farming tower, um, or do I? Hmm, if we do a second one it might look too crowded, I think. I want to um, build some of uh, shacks in this uh, design here in front of the table mountain. So this will be the theme I will be doing around here. And the farming tower um, actually fits in there quite nicely. Um, I will enlarge it by uh, two more or three more layers, so it ha um, will be yeah doubled in si in size. And um, yeah, ah, what to do with the pumpkin patch? Hmm. Yeah, I'll figure something out and cut back to you the uh for so that I won't be boring you with my poor decision making. See you back later. Alright, I made my decision what I would do and um, as you can see in the chat I f got another uh, achievement. I made some bread because I was running out of food and um, yeah I decided that I want to go with a organic looking um, patch of fields just like you see in those um, Minecraft villages with um, so uh, they're surrounded with uh, wood, uh, wood blocks, and um, um, I think this is the theme I want to go with. So uh, we have acacia wood, and I'm not so sure about those wooden planks. I might replace them with something else, maybe even with acacia wood. And I want to um, everywhere where there is a wooden plank will be a um, line of water. Then you got your pumpkin plant over here and the pumpkins can grow in this row and it goes on like that. I want two rows of pumpkins and I will be doing some more space for melons if we actually find some. So um, I will do a time lapse from now on until I finish that. Um, there will be some additional terraforming. Um, as you can see I closed off the um, cave entrance here and I will be um, digging up some more dirt, so see you later. Alright, and now to bone meal the pumpkin saplings so we don't have to wait as long to get our first... Um, you can never have enough of it, so um, yeah. So um, this will be a nice little patch just for uh, crops like pumpkins and melons as I said. Um, whoa, ah, okay, I clicked on the grass, so, uh, that wrote some. Um, as you could see, I did a little bit of terraforming there, so it doesn't look too derpy, but I might have to curve this a little bit, like, um, this over here, so it looks more, uh, naturally. Um, we'll see later on, um, how the time is going, and, yeah. Alright, so we should get the first pumpkins very soon. Uh, you don't actually have to um, clear out this as well, but you can do it. I think it doesn't matter at all, um, so I will just leave it like that. And we got our first and second pumpkin, very nice. So I wanna replant the sapling real quick. and. Yeah, I like how this is looking. 
So I hope we can find some melon seeds um, somewhat in the near future when we go caving again. Um, right now we have our wheat farm going and um, I just want to enlarge it um, make it bigger to get some potatoes going. But before I can do that I think I will just plant them uh, regularly. Um, because I don't like a, an unfinished farm so I will clear out uh, our old little farm here. Um, we might do something with the... Oh yeah, we can totally do that. We can do something with the um, sugar canes over here. So they look actually nice. Um, I think we can do another patch like that, just um, at the side of it. Mm, yeah, why not? So I think just like it and... or above it. Hmm, we, we could build this up with a fence post like this or with um, with some more acacia wood S but yeah I said I don't want to get a second farming tower so we I think we won't do that um, yeah I might clear out something ah why not um, I will clear out um, an area for this here um, I will oh no we got a lava lake over here hmm what to do Oh, I didn't see that hole. Oh, we d we totally saw that hole before. Yeah, um, so for the time being, I think we won't do anything with these sugar canes. Um, yeah. So, um, as I said, caving, um, we don't have much diamonds till now, so... Um, <laughs> I said in the last episode I want to um, actually loot that ravine over there in the flower forest. So I will, yeah, why not? I will quick, uh, quickly make some myself some more bread. Do we have anything other to eat here? No. So um, no, we already got the bread. We want more. Can put that in here, that as well. We don't need as much acacia. Uh, why not? We got wood. We got some uh, of that. We can leave the stone hole here, and I will cut back to you when I'm at the ravine. All right. It wasn't a very far trip, but I had to um, sleep a night away and uh, make myself some new tools because those are quite worn out. So I will do this as another time lapse, uh, just because um, it's not that interesting to see just digging up some uh, resources. But I will cut back to you uh, when there's something interesting like diamonds and some other stuff. So yeah. Yikes. Okay, that wasn't very intelligent. Sorry for that. I'm now at the bottom of the cave. I think I got most out of the walls and as it seems there isn't a cave entrance down here. 
That's a bummer. I thought we might get to um, see a cave entrance and then uh, we could find a cave going way down. But um, as it seems, we just have to use a cave I found uh, a little bit up there, I think in this direction. And I will quickly check the episode time and um, if there's time we will start exploring that cave. If there's not, uh, we will um, do that next time. So let me quickly look it up. Alright, it seems we have some time left. So um, we can start exploring that cave uh, over there. Um, I will just quickly get that coal because it. Otherwise, it would just. Uh, yeah, kind of piss me off not getting it. Um. Very nice. So, as I said earlier, I want to go um, like a uh, village theme with our build over at the Table Mountain. And um, I don't want to build just a very, very big house because most of my builds that go uh, very big don't have a, a, a very sophisticated interior, if they have an, an interior at all. So um, there will be a few or a lot of small houses, um, maybe I decorate them um, in different uh, shapes and stuff. Um, I don't actually know right now, um, but I think I will come up with it uh, while doing so. So I think we got a, a very nice cave here. Um, I think the water is just coming from the river, if I am correct, or from the small lake over there. And uh, we can go down there, which is very good. I will just quickly get all the coal and iron. And maybe this cave even goes down to diamond layer, which would be very nice, because we don't have enough for an enchantment set right now. Okay. So another thing I was just uh, thinking of the top of my head was to um, later or um, in a week or so do a video from my, uh, the multiplayer server a, a um, SMP server I play on and um, I want to do a quick look around on that server um, on camera uh, what people are up to, what they are building um, and so on and so forth. We got um, some very good builders, uh, one in particular, but I will show and introduce, maybe introduce him um, when I do that video. He did our uh, Never Hub, it is looking very, very good, it's, it's looking <coughs> great. Um, and right now we mostly do um, some of us are just doing our own stuff, um, some of the others are uh, busy building the community builds like the town hall and um, the Never Hub is finished right now. Oh, hello. And I'm building a watchtower and a, um, a lighthouse. So I will of course show you that style I, or the design I'm going with. And yeah, I hope you're looking forward uh, for that as well. Okay, there. Oh, a creeper. I think I will just. No. Nope. Okay, that was very stupid, but I didn't manage to hit him another time. So I will just block this off for now, um, so we can peacefully uh, loot the re the other side of the cave, 
get the coal and so on. So yeah, as I was saying, I'm building a lighthouse with diorite and um, stained glass. And um, yeah, I will show you that the other buildings I already um, built. And hopefully I will get one or two from the server, um, maybe on voice or um, just describing their builds um, so you can better see what they are up to. So yeah, look forward for that. And I think I will just uh, fast forward from here on to um, get back to you when there's something interesting. Okay, um, I heard some noises over here, so hopefully there's a dungeon, something like that. Maybe just another cave. Oh yeah, we got something here. I don't know what it is, but it's noisy. So let's just kill those guys. Nice speed in that one. I don't see any mossy cobble, so I well, I don't think this is a spawner. Is there anybody else? Hi creeper. No, I think this is just um, another bit of the cave. So um, yeah, we might explore that later on. Okay, um, I'm back and I quickly look the episode time and we are out of time for today. So for the next time we will start exploring uh, this part of the cave uh, we left earlier. I finished clearing off that part and we got another part over there I think which will go deeper. So next time will be a caving episode I think. And I want to say thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me and my videos, and maybe the upcoming video from the server. And yeah, thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.